So my new Asus laptop had a screen dimming issue. This is a so-called feature that may appear on some laptops that makes bright images brighter and dark images darker. For example, when you're watching a YouTube video, the content on your screen is predominantly black, so your laptop absolutely automatically reduces the brightness level. And when you switch tabs to open a Google Doc, for example, everything on your screen becomes white and your laptop automatically increases the brightness, which is very annoying and only adds to your suffering when in the middle of the night you are trying to finish your school essay that should have been submitted yesterday. There are many methods described on the internet regarding how to disable it, but none of them work for me. Some people recommend to go to settings, then system and then display and to disable adaptive brightness, which is nowhere to be seen in my device. It is also recommended to go to power options in the classic control panel and to change your power plan to high performance, which is again not even available for me. They also say that going to change plan settings, then change advanced power settings and disabling adaptive brightness, which is located under the display category may help, but as you might have guessed, this option does not exist on my laptop. It may also be useful to go to Intel Graphics Command Center or any other graphics software you have and look for the display power savings toggle, which is located in System Power. In my case, it was already disabled and it is of no help to me. After a long time of searching, I found the only solution that worked for me. Press Windows key plus R, type Rec Edit. Click OK and here we go, the registry editor. You should navigate this path. You can find it in the video description. Just copy it from there and paste it into the field up here and press enter. Once you navigate to this folder, you need to find and change the values for these two registry keys. AC user preference policy and DC user preference policy. So find AC user preference policy and double click on it. In this little window, there is a value data field. Write down the original value you can see here somewhere in a safe place. I use Google Keep Notes. This way, in case something goes wrong, you will always be able to change it back to default. Then delete the original value and type zero, just a zero. Click OK. It may show you a warning message, just click OK. Now do the same with DC user preference policy. Find it, double click, write down the original value somewhere, then delete it and enter a single zero. Press OK. Make sure they have really changed. Now they should only have zeros here in the data column. Then close the registry editor and restart your computer. I hope this will make the issue disappear in the same way it did for me.